Hey there guys, it is C1less here, and in today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys what you need to buy for an almost perfect gaming setup, an entire setup including the PC, for around £600. <laughs> So first of all, you're going to want some high quality headphones. The Grado SR60Es provide this. They are open back, giving you a massive sound stage. And best of all, they are only £75. If you are switching from console, you're probably going to want something which you can adapt to the PC with. The Microsoft Xbox One controller with a wireless adapter for Windows 10 is the perfect combination for adapting to PC from console. This product only costs £50 as well, so it's quite cheap. You will also want to be using the keyboard and mouse in this setup, so you'll be wanting a pretty decent mouse mat, ideally an extended mouse mat. This is where the Perix DX2000 XXL gaming mouse pad comes in. It's an extended mouse pad, meaning that you can fit your keyboard and your mouse on the pad. Speaking of the mouse, the mouse I've gone with is the Logitech G602 wireless mouse. Coming in at £47, it's just a bargain for what you're getting with the mouse. It lights up blue, and as I've said, it's wireless. So that's one less wire to worry about. Where are most of your wires going to be going? The answer is the BenQ GW2270H LED monitor. I currently have an LCD version of this monitor and it works perfectly for me. It's 1080p and it just works like a charm. It has two HDMI inputs, one 3.5mm audio output and a VGA input. The computer can output perfectly to this monitor. What are you going to store all the computer's components in I hear you ask? Well that will be the Rosewell R363 Micro ATX computer case. For the computer I've entirely used the Boson 3.0 by Austin Evans so shout out to Austin and I'll leave a link to his channel in the description and a link to the video where you can find out all the components. However, the computer itself does total approximately £350, even though it is supposed to total $350. What you're getting with the computer is a 1TB hard drive, 8GB of DDR3 RAM, a quad core processor clocked at 3.7GHz, and an R7360 graphics card with 2GB of GDDR5 VRAM. The last product is a Victop mechanical keyboard. This is an 87 key keyless version, coming in at £20. And £20 for a waterproof mechanical keyboard is an absolute bargain. It has the equivalent to Cherry MX Blues, and I have it right next to me right now. I'm just going to point the microphone at the keyboard so you guys can hear how amazing it does sound while you're typing. As you could hear, they did have the amazing sound of the Cherry MX Blues and the tactile feedback of the Cherry MX Blues. With the addition that it's waterproof, so if you spill a drink on it, there's no need to worry. This keyboard is the perfect option at this price point. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. I'm gonna be building a version of this setup. However, mine's gonna be a dual monitor version with some speakers and maybe a few upgrades in the PC. But leave your comments down below. Tell me if you have built this setup or if you're planning to. I've been to one and I'm signing out.